In this video, I just want to give you a quick update about what's going on at my house with my ERV, the Energy Recovery Ventilator. Right now, I'm about halfway through installing it. I've been working on this project for over a month, and right now I've got about $2,000 invested in this, and I'm probably going to have to spend another thousand to complete it. I'm going to go over the cost of this thing in more detail in another video. Part of the reason why it's taken me so long to put this thing in is because I work so much. So when I get home from work, then I start working on the ERV. I put in an hour here or two hours there at night. Sometimes on the weekend, I'm able to work all day, maybe all day Saturday and Sunday. It, it's very time consuming, especially the way that I'm doing it. I'm not gonna get into too many details in this video. I'm just kind of showing where I'm at right now and what I've done. I am working on a full DIY installation video. As soon as I get done with this project, this installation, I'll be getting that video out. I think it's going to be really good. I've got a lot, probably over a hundred clips of video right now showing a lot of details. There's a lot of things that I could not find online. Even professional installation videos, they're not showing the details that I wanted to know so I think my video is gonna be really helpful to some people. As of right now, I've got the ERV hanging and I've got all of the return air duct run. The return duct is the duct work that pulls the air out of the house, the old stale, the contaminated air. It's gonna be sucked back out of the house into the ERV through this duct work. And it runs all the way. My kitchen's down there, starts over there. So now I have started working on the supply duct. That's the duct work where the ERV is blowing fresh air into the house. I will get into a lot more detail in the DIY installation video. And as far as my other projects, like my dump truck and other things around the property I've been working on, everything has just been put on hold. This ERV has pretty much consumed my life. Any extra free time I've got, I've been working on this thing. Part of the reason it's taken so long, it's lack of time to work on it but also i'm pretty picky about the way that i want it run or the way i want it installed i think if you watch the diy installation video in a couple of weeks you'll probably understand that and i'm just i'm really trying to take my time do a good job and especially like seal up everything with tape hvac tape and air duct sealant i'm trying to make sure all the duct is hung right and blah 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 i hope that i'm going to be done with this project in about two more weeks hopefully two more weekends and i'll be able to finish it up i'm happy with the way that it's going but i hate that it's taking so long i really like projects that i can get done in a day or two and then move on to the next thing but this thing is really involved there's so much to do there's just so much work to do and i'm crawling around in tight spaces in my attic but i do think the project's going good and I can't wait to be done with this thing and hopefully fix some of the problems that the spray foam is created. It'd be nice to be breathing some fresh air in this house.